Well, Andy, I guess not the result you were hoping for last week at Indian Wells, but as ever at this time of year, you've got a chance to get immediately back to action here in Miami, don't you? Yeah, I mean, um, obviously, tough loss, and, and Indian Wells had, had a ch chance to win that match in the third set against El Bonas. Um, but yeah, I got here nice and early, so had some good preparation, time to get used to the conditions here, which have been you know, pretty tricky, windy, um, hot and humid, um, and very, very different to Indian Wells, so um, yeah. Obviously, for obvious reasons, after Melbourne, you did take a, a bit of time off. Did you always expect it was, um, does it always take a little bit of time to sort of uh, regain your sort of winning rhythm after a little break like that? No, I mean, I think, uh, you know, obviously got some matches in the, the Davis Cup, um, you know, played some good tennis there. And, you know, Indian Wells has always been a place where I've, I've struggled a little bit, not not felt very comfortable there. And, um, you know, it was, was a tough tournament again for me this year. So I'm hoping that, um, you know, getting to Miami, familiar surroundings, conditions that I like here, I'll be able to, to play some, some better tennis this week. As you say, it is familiar surroundings. It's almost like a home away from home for you out here, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, I actually haven't been here for a year. Normally I do my training blocks out here, but, you know, with everything that was going on uh, last year, with, you know, Davis Cup finishing late and um, baby on the way, you know, as, as well, I kind of uh, didn't spend as much time as, as usual out here, but yeah, uh, I'm very familiar with it. I do like it here. I have a, an apartment here and I uh, spent a lot of time training on the courts um, at the venue, so I'm hoping that it works out well for me. As you say, though, it, it is very different conditions this year. I mean, I've never known it to be so cold even sort of yesterday and certainly this morning. I mean, have you ever experienced conditions like this and how different is that going to make it out there on court if it stays like this? Yeah, I've, um, yeah, I've seen conditions like this before for sure. I mean, it's, it's normally pretty windy here, but, you know, the temperature did drop um, yesterday. Uh, first few days I was here, it was extremely hot, um, you know, and I expect as the, the tournament sort of you know, gets uh, gets going, it'll start to heat up a little again, and um, yeah, I'm used to that.